Hello my loves and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having an amazing day and are doing super well as always. So for today's video I'm going to be sharing with you all my lush Halloween wish list for 2022. Now I didn't actually do this video last year mainly because the video idea never really came to mind but I just thought it would be a great video to film considering we are basically a month away from the release of the Halloween collection now which is so so exciting. Like the fact that we are getting even closer to autumn like every day it's just like literally I'm so happy so excited I popped to home since today and they have already got all of their autumn range all of their autumn collection out may or may not pick myself up a pumpkin spice candle and it's only July but I'm not going to talk about that <laughs> but yeah I really hope you guys enjoy the video grab yourselves a coffee or a snack and get comfy and let's get started so this wish list is obviously going to be everything that I plan to buy when the lush Halloween range comes out on August 31st and obviously I do have quite a while to wait about a month and a bit to wait but I thought this would be a good idea to film let you guys know what I'm planning to buy obviously talk to you guys about what you all want to buy as well and yeah just talk about the Halloween collection talk about autumn as it is my favorite time of the year so I'm just going to get on with the wish list so the first item I have on my wish list is of course the Lord of Misrule body spray and I've been wanting to get my hands on this body spray now for about two or three years it only had one release I think back in 2017 or 2018 I can't really remember but I've just always wanted it I absolutely love Lord of Misrule you guys know that it's one of my all-time favorite scents and to have it in a body spray spray would be absolutely amazing and to just keep it in my handbag and be able to smell like Lord of Misrule like on a day-to-day -day basis just makes my heart so happy so that is definitely on my wish list if you guys didn't already know Lord of Misrule consists of scent wise is patchouli black pepper and vanilla and it's a really beautiful spicy warming like autumnal slash like Christmas scent it's really really beautiful so I'm really really hoping to pick one of those up and I think price wise i'm guessing this will be about 20 to 25 pounds ish probably the same price as all of the other all year round body sprays so yeah that's just a guess don't you know quote me on that i'm guessing it's going to be that sort of price because it's like a seasonal one they may put the price up a little bit but the body sprays do last a really really long time and the scent lasts so so long on your skin so either way I will be picking one up so yeah that is the first item on my wish list next item on my wish list is the Lord of Misrule candle and to be honest I don't really think I need to say much about this it's Lord of Misrule it's a candle two of my favorite things put together into one I'm obviously going to absolutely love it and I'm going to absolutely want that on my wish list and I just think it's a great idea from Lush obviously the creators know how much everybody loves Lord of Misrule obviously including myself so I'll definitely be picking one up I just really hope that the scent of the candle is really really strong and it will sort of fill my whole bedroom because the plan is when I do sort of like decorate for autumn in September I'm hopefully going to get the candle and then have it on my desk like my bedside table and then I can just burn it before I go to bed or like burn it when I'm in my bedroom like on a day-to-day -day kind of basis so I'm really hoping it's the kind of strong Lord and Misrule scent that we know and love and the kind of scent that will fill the bedroom instead of just being a subtle Lord and Misrule scent so we'll have to see but yeah I really really want to pick that up price wise I think it's going to be the same price like with the body spray like the same price as the all year round candles so I'm guessing about 12 pounds I'm not sure we will have to see but yeah that is the next thing on my wish list next up on my wish list is the Lord of Misrule bath bomb and this is definitely on my wish list this year because it's gone back to the original design that it used to be all those years ago I say all those years ago not last year the year before was the last time it was the original design but it's the original design again it's a beautiful dark green color and it has red like a blood red color in the middle that explodes in your bath and it's just a beautiful Halloween autumnal bath bomb so I will definitely be picking one of those up obviously it's all of so it's the same scent as all the other products that I've just mentioned but price wise I think it's going to be about $4.95 to be fair last year it was $3.95 but I think that's because the like bath bomb like bath bomb design like changed but I don't know we'll have to see but I'm guessing about $4.95 but in my opinion it's completely worth it because I see it as like a treat bath bomb it's definitely a bath bomb that I'll use for like a Sunday night pamper routine if you get what I mean but nevertheless I will be picking one up I just I'm not sure on the price yet the next product up on my wish list 
is a bubble bar and it is the labyrinth bubble bar and again i mainly want to pick this up just because again it is lord of misrule scented but i think that it will pair really really well with the lord of misrule bath bomb as well and it is a beautiful bubble bar as you can see from the picture it's absolutely gorgeous and i just think it will make the water a stunning color even when you use it without the bath bomb so yeah that is definitely on my wish list to pick up price wise i think I'm guessing it'll be about £5.50, like £4.95, that kind of price range, but we'll have to see. That's obviously just my guess, but I just think it looks a really cool bubble bar, and I think I'll be able to get about three to four baths out of it as well. Next up on my list is the Pumpkin Pumpkin Bath Bomb, and I get this every single year that it comes out just because it absolutely screams Halloween, it screams autumn, and it just looks like such a cool bath bomb, and I absolutely love it every time I get it. And I like getting this one mainly just because it's not a really expensive one i think it's about 3.95 four pound 50 so you know it doesn't go too out of your price range too over your budget if you get what i mean and it's just a cute little pumpkin so you can't really go wrong and i really really want to pair this um with like some lord of misrule shower gel or like part of the monster mash fun from this year's range i just think it would go really really well together but price wise like i said it was four pound fifty last year i'm guessing it's going to be four pound fifty this year and scent wise it's a really really spicy autumnal like pumpkin spice kind of scent and i really really like it because i love spicy warming scents they're definitely my favorite kind of scents from lush and yeah i'll definitely be picking one of it i can't speak one of those up because i really really love that bath bomb the next product on my wish list is the cyclops bubble bar and this is going to be a new passion fruit scent which i'm all for i absolutely love passion fruit scents in my opinion definitely more of a summer scent but i still think the bubble bar is a really really cool design it's got like that little eye in the middle and i love the color of the bubble bar as well i think it's really really beautiful but i want to pick this up just mainly because like a lot of the other bath products this year apart from the pumpkin pumpkin they they're just not like screaming out to me if you know what i mean i'm not like desperate to get them like last year's products i was desperate to get them like i really really like the look of them whereas this year they're just they're not they're not doing it for me in the bath section unfortunately i hate to say it like I just, I don't know. I just find the bath section a little bit boring. I'm not going to lie. Like, like I said, I really like pumpkin pumpkin. I always get that one and the labyrinth bubble bar. And obviously I want to get the Cyclops bubble bar, but out of the bath range, that's, that's probably it. If I'm going to be honest, it's just, I don't know. It's just not doing anything for me this year, in my opinion. But if you guys love it, then obviously that's great. Just for me, not so much. But yeah, I'll definitely be picking up Cyclops. I think price wise, I think it'll be about four ninety five, and I think you'll be able to get about two to three baths out of that. And it's a Halloween type like design so you can't really go wrong the next product up on my wish list is the monster mash fun and in my opinion this is probably one of my favorite products from this year's range and out of all the ranges from like past years as well i think this is such a good such a, like a cool idea and a really really incredible product to bring out and they should have brought this out years ago i just think it's absolutely amazing because you can do so many things with fun and to combine four halloween like bath bomb scents all together i just think is a really really good idea so off the top of my head i think you've got just trying to remember batter ghosty pumpkin pumpkin and i think is it alien oh i'm not completely sure i think those are the four scents but i really really like this as well because obviously you can use each part of that fun like each scent um to go with the equivalent of the bath bomb and you can make bubbles with it so i think that's a really really cool idea as well i'll definitely be doing that with the pumpkin pumpkin the pumpkin pumpkin bath bomb as i think they would work really really well together um price wise i'm gonna guess this will probably be about nine pound because that's the standard price for fun but it could be a little bit more just because it is a halloween exclusive but we will have to see but yeah i really really love the design it's so cool so spooky so like halloweeny if that's even a word but yeah i'll definitely be picking one of those up as it looks super super cool the next product on my wish list is the toil and trouble body scrub and i just think again with the monster mash fun this is such a good idea i absolutely love the design of it you've got like a little bat on the top and it's a gorgeous dark purple color and it looks like from the picture a really good like invigorative scrub which i really really like those are my favorite kind of body scrubs some are obviously a lot more soft than others but i really like the good invigorating scrubs that make you feel super super clean and like scrubbed and fresh afterwards and i just think this looks so cool and it says it's like a new herbal scent which i personally really really like 
I don't know if it's going to smell more like a garden or more like a sweet kind of herbal, but we'll have to see. But I do really enjoy those kind of scents around like October, September, October time of year. I think they go really, really well. So I'll definitely be picking one of those up price wise. I'm not completely sure. I'm going to guess, it depends really, because if it comes in a small pot and a large pot, a small pot will probably be about seven or eight pounds and a large pot will probably be about 12 pounds. So we'll have to see. But either way, I will be picking myself up a tub of it because it looks so, so cool. Again, super spooky, great for Halloween and a great idea lush. So well done, lush. You've done a really good job again <laughs> the next product i would like to pick up is the blood orange shower gel and i again think this is a really really good idea because not everybody loves lord of misrule it's hard to believe i know because lord of misrule is amazing in my opinion but not everybody likes lord of misrule so this is a really really good alternative halloween shower gel to go for when you're not a big lord of misrule fan and it's a new blood orange scent and i absolutely love the smell of blood orange like a blood orange juice drink is definitely my favorite kind of orange juice so i can imagine what this is going to smell like it's going to like smell really orangey really like fruity and i'm completely here for it i love those kind of scents like i said not really in autumn time but i'm still going to pick up a bottle and try it because nevertheless i think i'm going to like the scent and it's a gorgeous like red orangey color so yeah you've got that as well price wise i think Obviously, it'll be a standard shower gel price. I'm guessing this small bottle will be a probably about like £7. Medium size will be like £14. Like large, I'm guessing, will be about £21, £22. We will have to wait and see. But I think I'll only be picking myself up a small bottle just to try first because obviously I have a lot of things on my wish list I want to buy and it's going to come up to quite a hefty price, if I'm being honest. So I need to be careful with my money and what I spend because I do want to buy the Christmas collection as well. So we will have to see. But yeah, this is definitely on my wish list. I think it looks really cool, so I will definitely be purchasing it. Next up on my wish list is a shower jelly and that is the Tarantula Shower Jelly. And and this is a new cherry amaretto scent. So I'm guessing it's going to be sort of like a almondy cherry kind of smell. I'm, I'm, I'm not sure. It doesn't really give much away from the spoiler page. Like it just says cherry like amaretto scent. So I'm guessing it'll be on those kind of vibes. But not going to lie, I'm still going to pick this up because I think I love shower jellies. And I think it's a really cool idea. But I don't know how I'm going to feel about like holding that spider in my hand. Because I just... I. Oh, I just hate spiders. I literally hate spiders. It's probably probably my biggest fear. That and clowns is probably my biggest fear. But yeah, we're going to have to see how it goes. But I still think it's a really cool idea. I was okay with the monster octopus last year, but I just, you know, I don't really have a fear of octopuses. So we'll have to see with a spider. But yeah, I think price wise, I think it will be like monsters octopus last year, where it only came in the one large size. And I think that was about £7.50, £8. So I'm guessing this will be the same sort of price range. We'll have to wait and see, like I said, but nevertheless, I will be picking one up because I still think it looks really cool. I just don't really know how it's going to feel on my hands, but we will see. <laughs> Next up, we have the Mr. Pumpkin Face Fresh Face Mask, and this is definitely something I'll be picking up. If you guys saw my reaction to all of the Halloween and Christmas spoilers, this was like up there for what I really want to get because I wasn't into the um, like subscription boxes and stuff like last year when this came out in the Fresh and Flower box so I never got to try it but I heard it smelled like a really nice pumpkin spice latte so obviously I want to get my hands on it autumn's my favorite season I love everything pumpkin spice so I will definitely be picking that up price range like price wise I think it'll be about 10 pounds same sort of price as all of the other fresh face masks and it looks orange and this what well, looks orange it is orange and it just looks like such a cool face mask and it's just giving me Halloween and autumn vibes. So yeah, we'll have to see if I can get my hands on that. But yeah, I just really like the look of it and hopefully I can buy it and try it for you guys. And the last item on my wish list for Halloween 2022 is the Vampire Kisses lip scrub and you guys know I absolutely love a good lip scrub I'm definitely getting quite a big collection of lip scrubs if you guys want a lush lip scrub collection please let me know I do have enough to do a collection now but I'll definitely be picking this up because it is a new sour grape scent and I absolutely love the scent and I love the taste of grapes I just it's one of my favorite things and anything sour I really really like as well they had the sour lime trickle treat lip scrub last year from the collection and I still have that I'm still trying to get through it 
it and I really, really am enjoying it. So I think I'll really like this one. Again, it will do the same thing to your lips, like exfoliate them, give them like a nice feel like all of the other lip scrubs do. But I'm still excited to have this one just because I love a new lip scrub. It's a like seasonal lip scrub, it's a Halloween lip scrub and you can't really go wrong. So I'll definitely be picking that up. I think price wise, it'll be the same price as all of the other lip scrubs on the website now. So I think it'll be about £6.50, £7, but totally worth it in my opinion because the lip scrubs last such a long time and this one just looks really, really cool as well. So I'll definitely be picking this one up. So that was it for my Lush Halloween wish list for 2022. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know down below what you guys are really really wanting to try from Halloween this year like from the Halloween range I would love to know and I would love to know what's on your guys's wish list so yeah let me know in the comments down below I would love to have a chat and yeah just find out what you guys are really really excited to try make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoy as we are on the road to 700 subscribers the last time I checked I think we we're about 30 away which is not that many at all so if you guys enjoy this kind of content then please make sure to like and subscribe as i do obviously have more autumnal and like halloween and christmas content coming from september onwards so if that's the kind of thing you guys like to see hit that subscribe button because more of it is coming i hope you all have a lovely rest of your day and i will see you all in my next video thanks for watching guys bye